Right, I've got my replacement camera. It's uh, it's another Apto. Um, I don't know how clear that is. And it's it's like the other one, but the my first camera was um, was yellow. This is the upgraded one. So the other one's G1. This is a G1S. Um, the reason I got, although the other one failed on me, the reason I got one similar in the similar in the same make was because I just liked it so much and it gave good results and it's got a seven hour battery. Uh, the red light flashing means the remote is, is activated. This is the remote control. Um, and if you press it, one button, it takes a photograph. And if you press the other button, it starts um, videoing. Uh, in this case, it doesn't, but I'm not too worried about that. I'm gonna mount it on my camera the green light just means that it's active take a photo you can press it if it's up on the handlebars like so and then some sort of bracket like this and if you press it uh, for a longer press it starts flashing and it's doing video it's fairly simple stop it videoing uh, if you take the back off with one hand, yes, you can do it. It's got it's got a USB uh, connector. This this camera is not very good for focusing, is it? It's got a, a US a mini a micro USB connector. It's got a reset button up here. Uh, that one in the middle is what gets pressed by this little knobbly bit here. Excuse the technical terms. You can also put the brass bit there as a screw in for a Wi-Fi aerial. Um, so it's it's fairly straightforward. Uh, it's water waterproof, and uh, and I I really quite like it. I've I've made some videos today for the first time uh, when I went on one of my advanced rider courses training, and uh, I had it mounted up on up on here, but lower down. And that uh, gave me quite a poor result because of all this uh, dashboard at the top here. So half of the film was, was dashboard. So I'm going to try it up here uh, next time and just to get a clearer view. Where I normally mount it, or where I used to mount my old one, was down down by the um, uh, the engine here. And you got a, you got the engine noise, etc., which was good. And if you turn. It's nice and tight. Turn it around like that. And I used to get quite good results down there. So I might go back to that again. I don't know yet. Uh, I've only got it um, yesterday. So I'll just have to see how it goes with the, uh, the results. It's flashing red now, which again means the, uh, the remote is activated. And that's the Wi-Fi activated. And press the button again on the back and that stops them both and it's back to just normal operation with the green light i like it